Hello and welcome everyone, our heart here with part 29 of my Grom the Paunch Let's Play, Total War Warhammer 2. So, picking things up, we left them last time. Hopefully today's episode is going to be less buggy and be crash-free, unlike last episode. What a start to the week that was. Also, I should say thanks to everyone that gave me feedback on my microphone settings. Sounds like I'm back to what I, I should be sounding like. Uh, looks like I've got all my settings uh, set up the way they should be after everything reset. Uh, on Monday. So yeah, thanks for that feedback, guys. Greatly appreciate it. So yeah, we've got 31k to spend. Uh, I think I've moved most of my armies. We've moved Grom and Itchy. Um, Grievous Blackbog, you can move. So we'll bring you into the water. Start bringing you back over towards the Black Pyramid because then we'll uh, attack that with multiple armies. Then we'll retrofit our armies, sail to Sartosa, and then after we've taken Sartosa, we'll pop our war and then begin the final act of this campaign, which is our invasion of Everest. And obviously, the final action we'll take is to fight the uh, Black Tooth Revenge when Everest is the final settlement uh, that uh, Eltharian has left. Uh, I'm kind of torn as to whether I'm going to take Orion's camp. Some of you guys saying, yeah, go for it. Complete all the, you know, complete the full conquest of the Southlands. Uh, don't leave, uh, you know, a little hole in your borders there. But at the same time, I like the idea of leaving that raised as a sort of a threat to anyone else that dare challenge Grom. So we'll, we'll leave it as is for now, but um, I might revisit that. Uh, Dawn's Light Run, start spending all this money. Pop it all in. Scraggle. Yeah, have that. Have your defenses as well. There's some places where I might actually consider getting rid of the defenses so we can have the raiding stashes in there as well, especially for port settlements. Uh, although over here we won't get rid of it just because I'm not going to be surprised if the uh, Blessed Dread declare war on us at some point, but then we'll raise another army down here somewhere to just keep them busy. Because obviously we're pulling everyone back to go to the Pyramid uh, and then north to Altharion and Everest. Um, but yeah, one army down here should be enough to, to keep the Blessed Dread away at least to start with. Uh, what are we going to go for here? Uh, to increase Shaman uh, capacity. Serpent Coast, you can have that. Um, we can go for... Yeah, polish on stuff. If I'm, I'm going to get rid of your defenses, actually. I'm going to risk it. Because I think we'll have plenty of time to get an army up here if the Blessed Dread starts sailing this way. Um, that we can defend it with. But and when I get rid of that, I can then build the raiding stash. Because we just want that everywhere. Because uh, maximize our loot and occupy and our sacking and raiding income. Uh, Temple of Skulls. Uh, Cursed Jungle. You've already got and that I don't think Cursed Jungle has a resource building that we need to put in there. No, so you can keep your defenses. I uh, won't upgrade that just yet because there's got to be there's got to be some income stuff somewhere. Oh, and talk. You can have raiding stashes now as well. Uh, you guys, uh, Goblin Sawmill, about to upgrade or starting to upgrade. Um, I will. Yeah, I won't put walls in there. We'll just leave everything. We've got to wait until you're tier 3 to have stuff in there. B -b -b um, none of that. So that's more research rate? Yeah, chuck it in. Not that we've got much research to do at the moment. Not much left anyway. Upgrade that. Good, that's the money spent. Hero not moved. Oh yeah, bring you over as well. Send everybody north. You guys are a little bit unhappy. That's just because of conquest. Yeah, provincial instability. You should be fine. Um... Actually, yeah, maybe that's a point of what we should have in here. We should go for that instead. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. Old Drock, you're chilling here. I mean, I could... Try and assassinate. Yep. Good work, Drock. You need one more level, then you've got your immortality. Put your specialist done. You've got all your blue except for scavenge, which is now done. Good, good, good. Uh, commandment available. Yeah, Sea of Dread. Growth and obedience. Uh, yeah, we won't need that for long, actually. Now, you know what? I'm going to go for income extortion just because that's already at tier 5. And they're already upgrading and, yeah, not a problem. Uh, Gorgazan, yes, you guys were saying we can get the Oath Gold Mine. That's what I probably should build, but we'll we'll pop it in next turn. Note to self. Start of the next turn, Lionheart. Oath Gold Mine. We'll pop in... Actually, yeah, if I, if I get in that... 
the biggest bones. I won't be able to get that one in there. That's Winds of Magic Powers, though, plus 10 all armies. Capacity for Shamans. Uh, no, Oath Gold Mine, definitely more income. Uh, Gorgazan. You can get the uh, Black Orc Forge. So let's throw you into upgrade as the last thing we do. Uh, one, two of you saying, be careful of Zandri is going to get attacked by these uh, rogue army pirates. No, they shouldn't. They don't come on land. Um, they just stay in the sea, so they shouldn't be a threat. So yeah, I think we're all good for the turn. Let's end it. Obviously, should get a fair bit of progress done next episode. Part 30, our, our hour special. Uh, I don't think we'll get to fight the Black Pyramid today. We might do. But if not, yeah, definitely next episode, fight the Black Pyramid and then head towards Sartosa. So then I would imagine part 31 through to... It's not going to take that long with, with our armies and wars, our war armies, smashing through Ivres. So I imagine probably by part 33 we'll have this thing, this campaign wrapped up. I'd have thought, unless something absolutely diabolical happens, if like all the Dark Elves suddenly show up here. But I don't think they will. Yeah, it's going to take us probably today's episode getting my armies over to the Black Pyramid. Um, if you do have any suggestions for retrofitting my armies, do let me know down in the comment section. I'm probably going to record part 30 straight after recording this one, though. Um, but I think we'll still have time, you know, part 31 to, to tweak some armies ready for the invasion. Um, Grom, there, there are better units potentially we could put in there, but I quite like his army. It, it sort of works fairly well. I like the fact that we've got those cheap old gobos in there. You know, I like to theme my armies a little bit. I know we've got a lot of trolls. Maybe we could swap out some trolls. Something else. Maybe drop one um, pump wagon. I'm thinking losing one troll and a pump wagon. So there's potentially two more units we could we could pop in there. Um, you guys did say a while back you want to see a, a doom diver catapult in there. So maybe get rid of a pump wagon and have a doom diver in there. But other than that, I'm, I'm fairly happy with, with how Grom's army works. Right, Lionheart, start a new turn. The first thing you're going to do is come to Galbaraz and you're going to build that Oath Gold Mine. Good, Lionheart. Good, good, good. Yeah, I'd, I'd like to get an army of Savage Orcs, actually, as well. That'd be fun. Um, so, yeah, if we aren't threatened by the Blessed Dread in the south, then I might well do a Savage Orc army in the north to go with Grom and have some fun. Uh, let's just go normal stance through here. Sail to the wreck. Order resolve the wreck. Ransom the captives because we're going to keep on replenishing. Uh, Helm of Discord, lovely. And lost cargo. Oh, beautiful. Income for all, re all buildings, all regions, plus 10%. Wonderful. And the growth, actually, that's quite useful. Yeah, Helm of Discord. Love me, Helm of Discord. Um, Nasty magic what have ready. you got? You've got the Trickster's Helm, which, yeah, that's, that's, that's better than the Helm of Discord for you, at least. Uh, have physical resistance. Yep, 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 yep. Um, go in here. What are we doing? We've done... Yeah, sneaky stabbers. And we've done biggest and strongest for the spider units. That's for orcs. And that is for rock lobber and doom diver catapults. We don't have any of that in here. Uh, I've got two orcs, but I think we need to worry about that. So, we'll start going through your spells then. Finally, at long last. Um, because you're already immortal. Because you're sort of a, a special character. Um, it's probably better. Actually, you know, I'm just going to keep sailing you up and grabbing all these islands, actually. That's what we'll do. There's a couple over here, actually. We could send... We could send Oglot the Horrible to go and pick up as we're bringing him north. Because, yeah. Ivress is just going to wait until we decide to, to go for it. So until then, at our leisure, basically, of, of when we get up there. Go, 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 go. Serpent Coast. I'm going to give you yeah, the Raiden Stashes. I'll create that. Go on up here. Wait for everyone to get up there, pretty much. So yeah, Oglock, um, go the Mysterious Island here, which you should activate. Yeah, just in range. I will go for those who escaped. Favorable winds. Prefect. Then I can turn you around and go after that one, up to that one, and then on land yourself. Good, good, good. So yeah, probably a bit of an economic episode today, I'd have thought. Um, oh, that building, that didn't get the upgrade. Let's do that first. That's more important. Yeah, 
Yeah, we'll wait until you're not tired and exhausted next turn and then hit more of their agents. So they've got, they've got, well, two and a bit armies plus a full stack in the Black Pyramid. So we're going to want two or three armies to match. Well, actually, we're going to want at least three armies. Night Gobbo War Boss. Uh, Gork and Mork. That's, yep, that's good. Um, and then we've got to go through that one. And then that top line come from raiding, sacking. Yeah, actually, we could all just go while we're waiting for everyone. We'll just sit in their border and start raiding them. That should be pretty good. Uh, you guys were saying I should, if I'm not going to take uh, Orion's camp, I should go go through it just so I can search it. See if there's a see if there's a puzzle. See if Lionheart fails at the puzzle. I mean, if it's one of those ones with all the the lines on it that I can never match up, then um, yeah, I'm not I'm not going to do that. I really, there is a mod that rotates them all the right way from the, from the start, but um, yeah, I I really should install that. And there's also there's also a, a Steam guide that people link me every time I um, every time I fail at one of the puzzles as well. But yeah, again, just mid recording, just <laughs> I just can't be bothered to to tab out, find the specific puzzle, and then and then do it. I just it's more fun to have a have a guess, a blind guess. Uh, big boss, where are you? You're over here. Actually, yeah, damaging walls with you would be, would be a good idea. Um, I'd, let's send you up this way because I want to see if the Dark Elves have hit the the western side of Ulth One in this. So that was a confederation between Nagaron and the Cult of Pleasure, Malakith and his mama getting together, but not for the first time. Oh boy. Hawk says what? And Gork also says what? Alright, go through there. I think we can force march through some of them. Yeah. Those who escape. Noise. Scanged. Sweet. And a power stone. I've got I know I've got that helm of discord. What I'll probably do is before we go to the black before we fight the black pyramid, I'll make sure everyone's got uh, equipment. You guys are fine on public order, good. Uh yeah, go for that for the research boost you might as well have that as well what you want? Yes, boss. oh yeah drock I'll take him out, boss. nice immortal for you beautiful yeah, so we finished that research uh untainted faction why that would be that'd be useful for especially when we go after sartosa because that's going to be full of uh, vampiric corruption so let's grab that first and then go for that one Plus, um, yeah, that's got vampire corruption as well. This way. this way. There's an island over there, but we could we could spend we could spend ages just going after islands. By the time you clear some of them, more have respawned. Fine. Yeah, okay. Go to the fell cargo. Can't remember if that's a battle or not. Uh, barrels of rum, wax sealed rations. Ah, oh, even better. <laughs> that one alongside the one that improves the uh, income from all regions. Yeah, minus ten percent upkeep for all units. Beautiful. Beautiful. This magic is real. Do, 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 do. Blessed dread are are heading over here. I mean, as I said, I'm I'm not going to be surprised if they suddenly turn on me but we are we are improving Every relations with them so if we can get it you know remotely positive um we might be able to get a treaty non-aggression because i think it's Stick. unlikely that nagarond will be able to confederate with blessed dread just because their strength rank one and two if blessed dread gets a lot weaker Bring then maybe get confederated Actually, i should have just seen what the uh what pleasure was at give me an idea of what he's able to confederate I don't know if the AI kind of gets more of a an overall, as it were, on uh, on all other factions. If, if if the AI wants to confederate and it's decided this is the time it's going to confederate, it kind of I don't know if it cheats and it just pushes it through regardless of strength ranking or not. Um, but yeah, there's nothing else to really put in. The Albrights are getting that. Cool, 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 cool. Numas, you can have. You should really have walls. Um. 
That sounds like it's next turn's job. Oh, Avalon's peace out with you. They were at war, were they? Okay. Well, they've gone to war with Nagron, so that'll keep Nagron busy. But yeah, I don't... Even though we're at war with them, I don't think it's... They're going to appear. Don't think Malekith's uh, got that much of an interest in, in old Grom when there's many High Elves still Magic alive. Get, or you'll go. War? Yeah. But you're no threat unless I go into the water. And if I do... Well, actually, the next time I go into the water with any of my armies from here... Is going to be heading towards Sartosa. And then shortly after that, we'll have, uh, we'll have war armies as well. So, yeah. Good luck. Good luck going for that. Yeah, bring them on, all on over. And, yeah, right. Let's see how badly Lanhart fails at this uh, little puzzle. Oh, it's one of these. This is fine. Just got to work out the odd one out. Um, right. Well, there are two squares. There's two of the squiggles. There's two of the fang things. There's two C's. It's that one. Huzzah! How bad would it have been if it wasn't that? <laughs> Unhop blind. Yeah, potion of healing. Boom. Thing is, I just feel like the level of difficulty just jumps up between those puzzles. Between all, all, all the puzzles, I think the it's like the Sudoku one and is like second hardest, but that line one, that one always trips me up. I don't know, maybe maybe that's just how my, my brain works. Maybe that's the easier for, for for some. I think the line one's definitely dip more difficult because you want to rotate the thing in your in your in your mind's eye in your head. Uh, longer weapons or or defenses for the Arachnarok. Um, you already do some pretty decent damage. It probably would be more sensible going for scrap barding, just as a little bit tankier because it, it's not like it doesn't do good damage. That's bones versus large plus ten. Already has. 14. I would give a nice little boost to it, but no, I think I'll go for the go for the defense. Go for the armor. Uh, what can we do here? We can go reload time or winged ammo. I mean more range is kind of nice because it'll it'll be useful when you've got up against another army that has uh, artillery as well and if you can just slightly outrange them. Yeah, it's now 480. That's actually pretty substantial. I don't have enough scrap for that. Uh, we are going to need to actually make sure we've got some scrap next turn. Because we're going to want to go for the... Well, we could go for the, the squirrel, squirrel fish. What does that do for Grom again? Lightning strike when battles are present and ambush success chance. Uh, that's not crazy. But yeah, we need to make sure we go for or goldfish uh, and dragon tail. And then combo of whatever else uh, we want to go for. Uh, we've cooked everything to unlock it. Although have we done the have we done the blood, blood yeah, we must have cooked it right yeah we cooked cook, yeah cooked recipes so we have done them all at some point I just haven't stuck around with them actually yeah, got flaming attacks that would actually be really useful against the tomb kings uh, against the black pyramids so that's what we'll go for the blood pudding um that'll let me have that one and centigore milk yeah so none of those are what we need for again green or blue perfect blood pudding it is tasty. Get stabby. You're exhausted again, but there's one more of these. Um, they, is it Petrals neck tech? Yeah. But remember, what do they actually do? Col oh, they colonize ruins. <laughs> but hey ho, we'll keep killing them. It's just the AI base getting getting bored. Like, it'll send you back over here. Oh, the, the Sartos is taking the shrine of Loic. Okay. That's, that's nice. Uh, Zlatlan, yes. Definitely upgrade you because Golden Tower here. All the potential income we can get. We should maximize. Get that gold mine in there. Um, get that in there. Get that in there. Yeah, you were waiting for you to get to tier 3. Sorry, new mass. Uh, I'll see if I go through any more islands, though, because that might give me some money. The tribe's ready. Um, yeah, you might as well come up. Come up here and go for that island. We might get this one, actually. Shipwreck. Oh, we might have to fight. Yeah, we've got to fight that one. There we go. Explore the island. 
Porto resolved the island. Ransom the captives from the island. Force march on land? No, not quite. That's fine. All right, so Oglock. Um, can we search the ruins again? Like, will there be enough cooldown? Uh, if I do that, I get some more scrap generate. Oh, we've got enough scrap for another dish anyway. Um, let's leave that then. Pig kisser. Oh, yeah. You guys are saying I should give him his war boar. Sounds good. Get your gems. Get that. And, yeah. Raiden stashes. Ultra mountain. Have an upgrade. Good, good, good. I'm sweating bullets. No one wants that. And no one wants to buy uh, King Grom's bath water. <laughs> Yours now for only $9.99. Admiral of Car's fleet, don't be scared by my help. I'm, I'm not. You know, I'm, I'm fine. Uh, not. Just throw that upgrade in there. It's all righty toity. Yeah, we should set ourselves up nicely. I think we can probably end the episode sort of with our us launching the attack on the armies outside the Black Pyramid. And then we'll kick off our hour special part 30 with the with the battle for it. Sounds good to me. Nice one, Tim. Scouting for you. Lots of things being built. Uh, I don't want you just yet. I want Boss. you. There. Okay. I won't feel a thing. This is a pity. Which <laughs> is a pity. Nice. Um, yep, get that in there. Build up that. Yeah, Gorgazan, just because it's on our northern border, we probably should have defenses. Uh, I mean, I'm building growth there just because we're not building it at Gorgazan, just for now, while we continue to upgrade it. New mass. Yeah, walls, finally. Oh, that's what I should have done last turn. Totally forgot about that, didn't I? Um, we've got plenty of growth. Uh, Raiden Stash is next. Damn goblin king! Are we immune to attrition? Yeah. Oh. I can hear my cats fighting in the background. That's not good. Yeah, we won't force march him into the attrition. We'll just bring him here. Yeah, jump him up there. That's the quickest way to do it. Bring up my agent because they'll be useful. Scouting out. The boys are restless. Ivress, all their forces. Oglock, off you go now. You've done what you need to do down here. Go, 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 go. Grab that and then on land. We'll have everybody ready. But yeah, it'll be Grom, Itchy, and Grievous Black Bog that go in for the Black Pyramid. Black Tower of Grom. Um. <laughs> No, nothing we need to hop in there. I just realized how much money we have as well. <laughs> Very little. That's that's why. Um oh yeah. Dish. Dish, dish, dish. Thinking there's there's definitely something else we need to do. A dish, a dish, a dish. Blood and pudding. Ain't no words better. Uh let's put in lion meat. New no, new no, new no, new no, new no, new. No. Oh. That need to be. Why has that gone to nuggets and slime? Oh, it's, it's got to. Oh, it's got to have one of the beast bits. Mm, damn. Damn, 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 damn. Well, I mean, we can get away with not having that income from buildings and public order bonus now. The fire attacks is is pretty useful. Uh, we want the explosive shot for sure. Yeah, let's go for that. I think we'll be fine without the goldfish. Yum. 
Get in Grom's gut. He just checked provinces. You're going down Sea of Dread. Minus two. That's fine. We're upgrading that, so that'll counter that. Great Desert. You are negative at the moment, but you're improving. Land of the Dead. You're going down by minus one. That's really not a problem. In fact, most of these places, I really should be swapping everything over to, um, to taxes. Let's, let's go do that everywhere. Great desert. No, you're not at maximum, but you're still fine. Swapping over already. Land of Assassins. Assassini. We can upgrade that soon. So, yep. Give us all that extra income. Fortress of Dawn. Um... Yeah, we, we'll leave you on that just because you're getting growth up to tier 5. I guess if you're not tier 5, we won't change it. Cobra Pass. You're already upgrading to your next tier. So, yep, there you go. Uh, you guys definitely need to be on growth. You're not upgraded enough yet. Western Jungles. Uh, you're still working on the old growth. Uh, you can't get that because we don't have enough money. Um, <laughs> yeah, we'll leave you. Ash River. You have enough growth. You just don't have the money. That one does need upgrading, but that's fine. Dervishes, you're upgraded. Go for it. Shifting Sands. Yep. Southern Jungles. Yep. Uh, you guys aren't upgraded. Uh, you've mm, got the growth. You've got 370, to be fair, from all those ports. So, yeah, you can be switched over. King Beast, uh, you're getting there. Plus, you've got ports as well. There we go. What's well, actually our highest earner? Shifting Sands. Then Sea of Dread already. Wow. All those ports. And we haven't even... Yeah, these guys haven't even gone up to Tier 3 yet. Nice. What about, where is uh, old Zlatlan? What's that one called? I forget. Southern Red Rivers. Yeah, it's, it's sort of mid-table. You can definitely earn more. You should be able to earn a decent amount once we get the uh, pile of shiny stuff all in there because of the Golden Tower of the Gods. Does that have, is that just that one? Yeah, it's just that one that's got in there. Cool, 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 cool. Right. Yeah, we've done the we've done the cooking. Let's move to everybody else. Enter. Right, so yeah, we'll just start go raiding with Grom and Itchy. And bring up Greebits. Oh no! Got rid of Gormog. Bad times. Poor old Gormog. F in the chat for uh F in the chat. F, F in the comment section for, for Gormog. He was the one wandering around. Yeah, he was going to go see what was going up there. Tyrion, how dare you? Got to go right to his little goblin wife. Being killed now. You're breaking up families, Tyrion. All right, then. I'll do it. Done. Okay, 1,500. I'm assuming multiple, though, won't. Well, no, no. Actually, we still get a decent amount of noise. And we get some lovely scrap generation as well. They go and attack both of them. Yeah, it'll be tough, but it'll be manageable. There we go. So we'll attack. Oh, they actually got up to full three full stacks. So they've got they've got four armies. And I've got three. But we've got flaming attacks on. Oh, it's only Grom. Oh no! Just realize how many of you have commented that like, saying Lionheart. No, 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 no. Oh, that, that, damn. That would be very powerful, though. Ah, oh, nuts. That's not as good as I thought, but the, the furry um, convocation is still useful. Ah, oh, that would be... Are they... Oh, oh, sorry. Oh, it is Grom's, Grom's army only gets fire attacks. Okay, it just... Ah. 
It says Grom only, but it's Grom's army. There's two enables flamey attacks. So I'm assuming one is for Grom and one is for his army. Okay, that that's you know it's still worth still worth doing. Okay, it wasn't complete fail. It's not all armies. It's just Grom. That's still fine as long as we attack with Grom. But yeah, with that with those flamey attacks, I think we can. I mean these three armies. Okay, maybe maybe not that one's not complete trash, but these two are pretty much full trash. You've got a hero titan in there, which is a little bit scary, but other than that, yeah. Trash. Um, yeah, I need to build up Miss Scraps. We've nearly got that for Untainted, which is good. Get a strike in a few turns. Bring you up. Actually, yeah, no, bring you to the camp because I want to see if I can search it again. I don't know if I can or not, or whether there's a turn or two's cooldown. We'll find out. Ratnik's over there. Bless Dread, still chilling. Oh, hello. You've come back. Uh, I mean, you will die. I could I could recruit another army. Um, if I do, actually, I'd, I'd kind of... I could just go for Savage Orcs anyway. Through global recruitment. Um, blah, 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 blah. They aren't armor-piercing, though, are they? You guys are. But, yeah, it would be kind of fun. Uh, we'll... We'll see. If they come on land anywhere, they're just going to get... If they hit a settlement, they're just going to die. Upgrade that. Um, Raiding stashes. Make a post battle loot. Uh, it would would be nice, but we should probably protect them. We should probably protect these isles. This doesn't give us any direct income, so that's, that's okay. Pop all that in. Hero not moved. Drocky drop drop. You are exhausted once again. Can't do anything to them. I can damage the walls though. But we should wipe them out in the in a field battle because I don't think they're gonna run because they'll they'll have four armies to my to my three. A <laughs> couple more turns and we can do it. Technology research, good. Oh, they've had a uh, rebellion. Far nice. Beneath an archmage. Just over there. Um, haven't I got an agent that I was sending up? Yeah. Actually, 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 surely, 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 surely we can recruit a hero here. Yes, we can. What do you want? Best idea yet. I mean, let's run back that way. No point chasing with Olog. Let's go. Be given a literal run around. Okay, so I can bring him in. Oh no! I, oh yeah, I can. Where? Is they're sort of hiding inside. Yeah, go go all the way in here. Flappy flap flap flap. Do that. Itchy. Go here. Do that because you get... I'm assuming the plus five defense that stay when we go into the battle or not. Who knows? Right. Grom. Strike. Declare war. In we go. Apparently that is a Mahusiv order resolve. But let's find out how Mahusiv an order resolve it should have been, or how how far in the balance power it is, by fighting that at the start of the next episode, which will, of course, be our hour special. So until then, I hope you guys have enjoyed. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Follow me on Facebook and Twitter, take Prime on the Legion. Check out my affiliates and sponsors, Games Planet and Overclocks UK. Till the next one, ciao for now.